Hi guys, it's me Malcolm, the movie Wizard of Oz himself. And I'm here at Regal Cinemas at LA Live, baby. Still one of my favorite places to go here. So I'm here to discuss my review of the awesome movie that just came out today based on the popular video game we all know and love, Uncharted. I'm so high, I can hear ever. Starring Tom Holland, Mark Wahlberg, Sophia Ali, Tati, Tati Gabriel, and Antonio Banderas. My God. I got it. This movie was legit. It was awesome. It was, it was full of humor and so epic badass this right here I did the, it, it was a little bit cheesy but it was still all right I I gotta say say Tom and Mark Tom and Mark did awesome together bring this video game movie to life it was a I do believe it was quite awesome though, but I do gotta admit that the character, I gotta admit, I do admire that they brought back Chloe Frazier as well. Into life screen as well. I mean, she was one of my favorite characters. She's like an Aussie version of of Laura Croft. Only this time, she, in the, she it was quite a backstabber. I mean, sometimes there's some ups and downs when it, co when it comes to Chloe. But I got a bit with the actress, Sophia Stewart. She was she was awesome though. But I do find it so-so. But I, but nothing compares to that other girl, Tati Gabriel. I got of it. She was quite a deadly fan fatal. I mean, after all, you did know. After all, if you have seen the chilly Avengers of Sabrina, you get what I'm saying. Oh, and let's not forget get her role in the 100. So, so, so this movie was was very awesome, though. It it really it really brought some um some brought some hits from the us. Uh, from the video games, like how, like how Nathan was, Nathan got accidentally got kicked out of that airplane, okay, which is similar to the one in Uncharted 3, okay. or how we get to see see him and his brother Nate when they were just kids. kids. It kind of reminds me. Of, it kind of reminds me of that. Mommy of Uncharted 4, how it, it showed flashbacks, flashbacks of them when they were kids. That was kind of nice though. <sighs> but I do, you know, one of my favorite scenes in this movie is definitely, oh, where they had the, where they had the two flying pirate ships, ships, where, where they had the pirate, uh, where they have the pirate ship floating with the helicopter helicopters attached to them, and I got it. It was a, it was it was crazy as hell. And I did love the ending though. How it no spoilers. 
but when I saw the ending, I do have a feeling that it's not over for the adventures of Nathan Drake and Sully. I do believe that it's possible they could make make a sequel out of this. But if so, I am so looking forward to seeing it. Because if they do make a sequel, there's only one character I would love to see, see in real life, in live action. Elena Fisher. Ow! Yes, Nathan Drake's future wife. I mean, I would love to see who, what, who's, what kind of actress who would play her. But you never know. So for my score for Uncharted, I do believe it was quite awesome, though. Though, it, even though Rotten Tomatoes were was kind of a stinker with its with its score, I still love it. So I think I'll give this one an eight and a half or an eight point five. Okay guys, I guess that's it. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and be sure you all stay safe, stay healthy, and make sure you all see Uncharted this weekend. Bye.